the good, the bad and the ugly we call this episode. Most of my time here I spend on Kapangan Island. Here you are a foreigner in their yeah. land yeah. and you'll never be accepted as uh, one of them. Traveling's amazing. Yeah. Don't ever stop. Hey champs, what's happening? Welcome to another episode of Tag Along With Chai. We are in the capital city of Thailand in Bangkok and in this episode we're after the good the bad and the ugly. We are going to approach random foreigners here in this park to seek for the good stories about Thailand, the very best stories about Thailand, the bad things about Thailand, the things that people like to see to be changed, and the ugly. These are gonna be stories that people like to share with us, the bad experiences here in Thailand, and maybe we can learn from this as well. I hope you're excited. Let's go, let's go, let's go. The good, the bad, and the ugly we call this episode. So we're first after the best, the very best moments that you had in Thailand. Well, I've stayed here quite a long time, so um, best moments, traveling around. Yeah. Uh, I stay in Bangkok now, but also live in Koh Phangan. I've got a business in Koh Phangan. Oh, okay. So what kind of business can I ask? A restaurant. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. How's that going at the moment? Like you're... It's got better now that COVID's... Yeah. Flights are still expensive to come here. Yeah. Once that sort of levels out would be better mm. but yeah it's uh, how long are you already having your business here in thailand and how long are you already coming to thailand i've had the business here about 20 years okay. but i work around south east asia as well yeah. so i don't just it's not my, my only thing i do uh, so i work in construction as yeah. well so. business is going well again it's yeah. it's up and running uh, again good pretty well uh, it's, uh, it ran all the way through covid but yeah Obviously not as many customers. If I can ask you the very best moment in Thailand, which one is really sticking out? When police beat Bure Ram, police terror beat Bure Ram, yeah. uh, 2 1. Ah, so you're not a big fan of Bure Ram, no? Or port, I don't like port, okay. I don't like Bure Ram. <laughs> okay. so police terror. Yeah, yeah, so Thai. So, yeah, I like, I like going to watch football and that, and yeah. Yeah, that's that's a good highlight. That's good things ah. to do around here. And so I know Thai football is quite popular here, but I didn't know it was for foreigners also. Um, it's not really most foreigners support Port yeah. FC, but okay, um, it's not really for foreigners. <laughs> there are a few foreigners play, yeah, but uh, it is geared towards Thais. Yeah, 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 and it's not particularly brilliant it's just a good day out yeah right okay it's more of the experience of being out uh, is it okay. yeah. yeah but no the football's great as well i mean yeah. it's you get to go to places like chiang rai kong ken places that you wouldn't go yeah. to right. um, Do you have like a seasonal ticket for uh, for it's 100 baht to get in the game so no ah, okay. i think, I think uh, Tero are the only club that don't have a season ticket every other okay. club does ah yeah yeah but for some reason Tero don't have them yeah, and the, um, we also talk about the bad, and the bad is more like what would you see, what would you like to be seeing change maybe in Thailand? Can't really say I live here, so I'll get kicked out of the country if I say it. <laughs> so that's is that right? Yeah? Nah, not really. You can't, <laughs> you can't criticize too much. There isn't. Once you get used to the culture, yeah. it's frustrating at first, but once you get used to the culture, it's. It's so okay. For you know, uh, for people that are thinking of moving here, what should they be aware of? If you're moving here, if it's to open a business, whatever you bring here, be prepared to lose. Yeah. You know, don't waste your life savings in doing it. Whether right. it's a house, whether it's your business, but it's, don't be, not leave yourself a nest egg. Yeah. That's the best advice I could yeah. get. Did that happen to you? Like, did you lose everything at some stage? No, no. I've seen people losing everything. Yeah. No, like I say, I work as well. Yeah. yeah. So I work in construction as well. Yeah. But if I did lose my business, so what? Ah, okay. Now we're uh, really at the ugly. The, uh, the very worst moment in Thailand or the, the ugliest moment that you had in Thailand. <laughs> Um, are there a few, are they? <laughs> there's a couple, but <laughs> yeah, okay. not really what I say. <laughs> no, no, you got me wondering. I can tell you off camera. I'm yeah, not okay. saying it off camera. <laughs> <laughs> well, so, uh, let, let's tell us a story that, that uh, you can uh, tell. Uh, no, I mean, there's, I there's a couple of stupid... I mean, there's nothing really bad. You get caught for traffic offences that traffic offences and yeah. you know there's the injustice of 
a lot of stuff, but you've just got to let it go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It is how it is. You're a <laughs> foreigner in their land, and don't forget that. Yeah, exactly. Do not forget uh, that for one minute. You know, we can be all snowflakes back in Europe and say yeah. everyone's welcome. Yeah. Here, you are a foreigner in yeah. their land. Yeah. And you'll never be accepted as uh, one of them. So you, you've got to remember that, and I'm fine with that. Yeah. I accept that. I totally accept that. Well, let me, by their rules. let me give you a, a, one of my little stories, which is underlining this, uh, this story really, is that I was sitting in a, a ute or a pickup truck uh, in the front without a seatbelt. Mm. A few of my friends are sitting in the back, like not having a seatbelt on because there's no You're seats there, the right? Back. Yeah, yeah. The police stopped us and I got a fine and that, you know, no yeah. one else was... <laughs> exactly. It's a bit twisted in my eyes, but hey, we can only smile. Go, go but, you get the sheet you can see it's on the sheet it says you cannot sit yeah. in the car without a seatbelt yeah. it says nothing about the back no no no, no so no. the rules are there yeah yeah yeah, yeah when yeah. you get a charge sheet it's there every everyone's well, there, I'm, so. I'm thinking as a as a foreigner especially if you're not really experienced here you can get annoyed by these these things Absolutely. but we shouldn't we should You've not got to accept it All right. thank you so much for your time do you have a message to the world uh, hiya mom <laughs> Send my trainers over, please. Is this your first time in Thailand? No. Uh, no. Very like experienced? Sixth, seventh. Ah, yeah. so you're quite experienced here. Yeah. We are searching first for the, the best stories in Thailand. Can you oh, think of man, one you thing? you got to talk to my husband. He has way more. He's in the library, the kids' library. He's okay. got a blue beard. Ah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you see him, he'll have No, but we, we talk about We talk to you now. What, 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 what's your... <laughs> I can't imagine, like... Oh, well, we got two small kids now. Like we, we don't good and bad and ugly. We don't really get into much of that. Um, <laughs> let's see. We yesterday we did Muay Thai with the kids. That was really fun. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, I don't have much ugly at the moment. No, no, no. But the, uh, we're searching for the. Be- You're going too quick, madam. Yeah. Sorry. We're basically searching for the best uh, uh, loose from the rock and roll style uh, lifestyle like th- that's not it's okay to be parents and uh, oh, you don't know yeah right <laughs> and i was like wow well, there's the thailand before kids and then yeah, there's yeah, the thailand yeah. after kids i don't remember the thailand before kids oh. <laughs> okay <laughs> it was that good was it yeah it was really good <laughs> so, yeah. but if you yeah. uh, lose from the fact that you're uh, parents now and um, yeah what's the best thing why should people come and see thailand uh the people are amazing they're so kind mm-hmm. It's super fluid. There's no um, hang-ups on gender or identification. Like you, you are who you are. Yeah. Love it. Yeah. Uh, I love that the monasteries and the military are right next to each other. I think that's kind of amazing. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's also. I think. Is it the only unconquered culture in Southeast Asia? Yeah. It is. It's, yeah, it's, yeah. it's, a, it's a remarkably yeah. strong yet mellow place. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Ah, I like that answer a lot. Yeah. yeah. And, and um, now about the things that you maybe like to see to be changed, like oh. something that is not so nice, the, the bad? The bad. Um, always the environment always needs help. They've got their, they're doing better than Indonesia in a lot of ways in terms of categorizing recycling and organics yeah. and all this other stuff, but there's lots of follow up. The rivers are gross. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So there's, yeah, yeah I would love. Mm. For the whole world, I think we should just yeah. clean it up. Seriously, I went to the, to Laos, the yeah. Mekong River, yeah. and the amount of rubbish that you see coming by, like tons no, of it. No, it's, it's really intense. Mm. Yeah, okay. well, Bali's um, pretty bad. I think that's, uh, that's already an ugly side, but yeah. something that happened in Thailand that I'm was very ugly. unpleasant or, yeah. God, I don't know if I have one. I, like, honestly, mm. legitimately. You know, like, I'm fortunate to be an experienced traveler. I, yeah just don't normally get into situations that will yeah. be super ugly yeah. uh, you know like I really my husband will he has a couple <laughs> <laughs> okay. that are okay. more complicated that okay. involve late nights and bars and yeah. lady boys and things like that ah. but um, but that's not really my scene so. no okay yeah. so yeah. If you, as long as you stay out of trouble yeah you... yeah you negotiate a little bit with the tuk-tuks you know like don't let them don't agree <laughs> <laughs> ever <laughs> yeah yeah right and just keep going just yeah, just yeah. try do your best and stay respectful <laughs> and oh. uh, yeah no it's a beautiful it's a wonderful place yeah. we love it here Hey, thank you so much. Do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to pass on? Yeah, traveling's amazing. Yeah. Don't ever stop. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You. Thank you. Bye-bye. So I've been in Laos for 10 years. Right, okay. Mm. What, it's none of my business, obviously, but what are you doing in Bangkok at the moment? 
Uh, actually, I came for some medical stuff and pick up a new camera lens. <laughs> oh, yeah? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's hard to get in Laos, is it? Or? Uh, yeah. Yeah, right. Yeah. So, how much experience do you have here in Thailand? Uh, I based in Chiang Mai for three years. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I was doing a lot of uh, village assistance, putting in water systems. And I do that in Laos also, and then I work with the Department of Information and Culture wow. and the U.S. Embassy to restore, uh, worked on a Buddhist temple for five years yeah. to restore that, and wow. then another uh, associated uh, stupa with that temple wow. for seven years. And where is this? Uh, in northern Laos. The good, the bad, and the ugly, we call this episode. So we're after uh, first some good stories. What's the best moment in Thailand you can think of? Well, I've had a lot of good moments in yeah. Thailand. <laughs> yeah. And... Uh, uh, I have a lot of good Thai friends, mostly yeah. all up in Chiang Mai. I mean, I have yeah. good friends here too, yeah. but uh, I always have good experiences here. Yeah. Uh, Is the one sticking out? Not particularly, except that when I like when I've done a lot of medical stuff here, and I'm always treated really professionally, yeah. and they're great. Yeah. You know. So maybe we can say that the good is uh, the medical. Yeah. Yeah. They're very caring. Yeah. And uh, nurturing, and uh, so that's that's my yeah. experience here. But okay. and also it's a little bit different. The north there is a distinction between the north and the south. Too. Yeah, yeah. I, I yeah. underline that always. Like I'm, I've I'm never actually in all the years I've been here, I've never gone south. Oh, ah, okay, so, okay. I've never gone south of Bangkok. So I, uh, and there's uh, a reason. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So I I feel that as well. And and yeah. Chiang Mai, I really love Chiang Mai. It's my my second home. Yeah. I call it. But I also like the South and I try to mix it, but I can see where well, you come from. I have good from. friends in Krabi who've been there for 45 years, yeah. American friends. Yeah. Uh, I did my partying in my 20s when I was supposed to. <laughs> okay. I'm 73, so no, I All don't right. do it All anymore. Right, sir. Okay, yeah. well, you look good for your age, sir, yeah, for sure. Yeah. yeah. But um, that, the good things about uh, Thailand are, let's say, the medical care and all that. What about... Well, I mean, it's different. You, it, you can't do a black and white conversation about it. Just no. like you can't about any place. No, no, no. Because no, no. it's very diverse. Yeah. Bangkok is one experience. Isan, the countryside is another experience. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And that's true everywhere. Yeah. You I know. think we should mention this as well. It's Thailand is very diverse and you know, it's very diverse. Yeah. yeah. How about the bad? The, the things that you maybe like to see to be changed in Thailand? Okay, now this is going to be I'm going to be so non-committal. Okay. Because as a foreigner, I don't even allow myself to have an opinion about it. Okay. To be yeah. honest with you. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I could say all kinds of things. Yeah. And be all kinds of critical. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, my phone is not ringing off the wall from the government for my opinion. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> and that's how I look at it. Yeah. I'm here. I'm grateful to be here. Yeah. Uh, I'm grateful for the, for the good. And... Uh, I could say that about the entire planet. Yeah, wow, that's uh, something I would. If you get my point. Hundred percent, hundred percent, and I definitely leave this in because yeah. this is also a message. Yeah. I, I like to share. Yeah. Um, because I can cherry pick. Yeah. And bring out the hatchet. Yeah. On yeah. everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it serves nothing. So, how about the ugly? Now we're talking about the thing or one thing that is maybe unpleasant that you experience here in Thailand? I've never had any unpleasant experiences here. No? I mean, I'm, I'm aware Honestly, of like... Honestly, honestly yeah. 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 No, I... Uh, but I don't go... I, I avoid problems. If you want trouble, you can find it. Yeah. You know. Okay. Yeah. But that was true when I grew up in the 60s. <laughs> okay. You know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. I, mean, I know where to find trouble if yeah. I want it. Sir, I really appreciate it. I'm yeah. really grateful to yeah. bump into you and yeah. have this My conversation. Good. Do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to pass oh, on? No, I don't. Just good luck. Are you on holiday or living in Thailand? I live in Thailand since May. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> so, uh, almost a year now? Yeah, oh, okay. almost. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we're basically making an episode about the good, the bad and the ugly. Stories uh, about Thailand, the good things, but also the, the ugly side of Thailand. What's the very best thing you would say in Thailand? What, what's really sticking out? Okay. It's uh, legal wheat. <laughs> oh, yeah. Actually? <laughs> yes. okay. Are you stoned right now? No, no, oh. I, I, did, I didn't smoke today. Is there anything else that I can imagine? Like, Thailand is full of good, good things. Yes, um, it's, here for me is uh, a lot of freedom people because it's my country is opposite. Ah. It's, it's, it's 
because of now it's all the situation mm -hmm. it's definitely free and beautiful and people so open yeah. and they're so friendly and I feel like girls safe here yeah. because I know if I go like some uh, European country maybe sometimes mm -hmm. even in European country I yeah. cannot feel myself safe yeah. but in Thailand in oh, you all in Asia yeah. yeah 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 in Thailand it's really safe for girls yeah, yeah. I think so too yeah, yeah yeah I'm glad to hear that from you also in the evening are you walking uh, outside alone in a park like this is also maybe yeah, uh, yeah not everywhere is, uh, is safe yeah but even oh. in the v uh, evening time mm -hmm. I feel myself really safe here ah, yeah that's it's good. good so this is the good yeah now the bad the things in Thailand that you maybe like to see to be changed um, I think it's uh, maybe all about people who live long term here, mm -hmm. e which one don't have like a uh, work permission visa or yeah. something like this. Yeah. yeah, you need to go to uh, get border run visa. Yeah. Yes. And you usually to pay to, for ch Thai people and they put you in like bus and sometimes scream at you like because you're far you know. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. And they don't like you <laughs> because you stay in this country. Yeah. You need to be tourists. And now the, the ugly, the, the, the really worst thing that you experience here in Thailand. Never. No? Never, never. Because uh, most of my time here I spend on Kapangan Island. Oh yeah. Yes. Ah. I live by the beach and it's like so beautiful and peaceful. It's like a village. Yeah. And here like big city, I'm a little bit confused. Ah. <laughs> Are you just here for your visa then at the moment? Uh, no, I changed my Russian passport because one of the Finnish and I yeah. have to get new one. Yeah, mm -hmm. and I already get it. Ah, Got good. It. Yeah. Good for you, good for you. Hey, do you have some wisdom or maybe a message to the world? message to the world oh please everybody be peaceful and consciously mm. and everyone will be happy okay <laughs> thank you so much the good the bad and the ugly i hope you enjoyed this episode we are based in thailand and we're showing you the beauty of southeast asia meeting a lot of interesting people along the way don't forget to subscribe to the channel hit the like button i would like to say from the capital city of thailand in bangkok bye for now and stay champ